Has John got a new motor? Does he like driving in his car like madness? Well, he does. Tell him to steer clear of any air uh, cues, especially cues at a uh, career's face, because he doesn't want to end up doing what the guy done in this novel. Hi guys, welcome to another video. Hope you're all keeping well. Now, um, it's book review time again. Uh, uh, so for this video, I'd like to talk a little, about it, a little bit about uh, this book uh, written by Stephen King and published in 2014. And that book is called Mr. Mercedes. Now, uh, this is the first part of, of the three, uh, this is the first book in the, th in the three parts um, uh, trilogy. Uh, featuring the uh, the character you know the main uh, the main uh, protagonist there uh, Bill Hodges uh, yeah so um, if you're not he's he's sort of like a, a retired uh, police detective and that you know yeah and he, he's aided by a couple of couple of like, sort of like uh, friends and that you know to solve this case yeah but if you're unfamiliar with Mr Mercedes I'll just read you the blurb uh, you know at the back of the book just to give you an idea of the story yeah so it's it's a riveting cat and mouse suspense thriller. Uh, about a retired cop and a couple of unlikely allies who race against time to, to stop a lone killer intent on blowing up thousands of people. Now, retired homicide detective Bill Hodges is haunted by the few cases he left open and by one in particular. In the pre-dawn hours, hundreds of desperate unemployed people uh, were lined up for spots at a jobs fair uh, in the distressed Midwestern city where he worked. Without warning, a lone driver ploughed through the crowd in a stolen Mercedes. Eight people were killed, 15 wounded, wounded, and the killer escaped. Now, months later, on the other side of the city, Bill Hodges gets a taunting letter in the mail from a man claiming to be the perpetrator. Hodges wakes up from his depressed and vacant retirement, hell-bent on hunting him down. Brady Hartsfield... Brady Hartby lives with his alcoholic mother in the house where he was born and he's preparing to kill again. So yeah guys, there you go. That's the uh, blurb uh, about Mr. Mercedes uh, from, from 2014. Uh, this is my favourite book in the uh, Bill Hodges trilogy. Uh, there the, what, the, what, the, what, the were two more, End of Watch and Finders Keepers, uh, but I didn't I didn't really enjoy them as much as I enjoyed the first one. Uh, you've got a real psychopath here, you know, in the form of Brady Hartsfield and that, yeah, and a good protagonist, uh, you know, a good protagonist in the form of Bill Hodges, and then it's sort of like uh, the couple of uh, uh, misfit friends who help him, you know, help him uh, get to the bottom of this case, try and solve it and that, you know, yeah. And it, oh, and the way that the way the psychopath taunts, you know, taunts Bill Hodges and that, you know, yeah, he's ruthless and that, you know, and he says like every time he kills and that, he, he says he expresses like he doesn't pull any punches about like deriving the you know it, it, deriving pleasure from murdering people and that, you know, yeah, and it does start with a bang this movie because you've got this this crowd of people forming, you know, for this big uh, job sphere, this 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 big career sphere. And I said they're all waiting to go in and that, and suddenly this car comes from nowhere and that, you know, yeah, and it plows into the, it plows into the crowd and yeah, oh yeah, yeah, it's a real, real sort of like a, real, real vicious opening this, real brutal opening this, guys, yeah, and it, yeah, just it kills and wounds so many people and that, you know, in, in you know, in, in the, you know, queuing outside for the job sphere, and then of course the story unfolds from there and that, you know, introduces the character of Bill Hodges and that, and his friends and that, you know, yeah. And um, yeah, it's a very enjoyable book, and that you know, it's not really strictly, it what it's not one of King's horror novels, but it's still it's more of a police procedural, uh, you know, a psychological thriller, and I thoroughly enjoyed it, and I said that's why I've kept it in my collection. Yeah, I think this is one of it, it Stephen King's best uh, non non horror novels, and that you know, yeah. And uh, you may know uh, if you if you if you are familiar with the story that he made a TV series, Mister Mercedes. I've personally never seen it. So if any of you have seen it, it, you know, let me know what it's like. Leave your comments down below. Yeah, but this is a great novel, this guys. It really is, yeah. And it, yes, it's one of King's uh, finest non-horror, non-horror works, and that, yeah. And it, oh yeah, did I say the way it starts off and that, you know, yeah, you know, just the car just comes from nowhere and it plows into these people and that, you know, yeah, oh yeah, it's pretty horrific and that, you know, yeah, yeah. So um, yeah, I highly recommend this uh, this novel to any anybody. 
uh, you know, even if you're not a Stephen King fan, it's a good psychological thriller, Mr. Mercedes. Uh, and as I say about the TV series, uh, as I say I've never seen it, but I'll try and get round to watching it and that, you know, yeah. And uh, yeah, so there you go, guys. That's me review of uh, Stephen King's 2014 uh, thriller, uh, Mr. Mercedes. Uh, have you have you seen have you have you read this novel? You know, leave your comments down below. Yeah, I'd be very interested to hear. You know, what your thoughts of it. Yeah, and as I said, the characters are, are really good in it, and that you know, a good story in that you know, uh, written in King's usual usual consummate consummate style. He's got a very very good uh, talent, you know, for creating characters and that you know, likable and believable characters and that. Yeah, and just throwing throwing them into all these these situations and that you know, yeah, and some very gripping situations in these in this book, guys. Yeah, there's one or two horrific moments now, aside from the. Uh, the job spear slaw, so with the with the car and that, you know, there's one or two other horrific, but I won't go into won't go into into those. I'll let you read the book for yourself. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, so that's my review of Mr. Mercedes and that. Yeah, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, what's your favourite Stephen King book? Leave your comments down below. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys. Well, uh, that's it. All going well. Uh, I'll talk to you all again soon. Stay safe.